What is going on guys, it's Cody B Pyrotechnics and welcome to our New Year's Firework Display. Okay, so this is our setup for the New Year's show and it's like the craziest firework show we've ever done. We have 2,000 canister shells in total which came out to be a whopping 20 cases. It took me and my friends countless hours to set all this up and we spent thousands of dollars on this firework show. So if you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like and share it with a friend. In addition to the 2,000 canister shells, we also have a ton of 500 gram cakes, 1-1 one -one cakes, and we also have four of the largest firework fountains on the consumer market. And now that we've shown you all the fireworks, it's time to explain the setup. So we've actually got three of these Cobra modules out here tonight and this entire display is gonna be scripted minus the shells and the finale, and we'll explain that later on. But as you can see, we've got the 1-1 one -one cakes, the 500 grams, and the fountains, which are actually behind us here. These are all gonna be hooked up to the Cobra. And if you guys wanna see the script that we're running on the Cobra, I will show that later on in the video. And I don't know about you guys, but 2020 has been a mess for a lot of people, and so it is time to go out with a bang. So we're here with Riley who actually helped set all of this up and I what do you did. think? I, I mean, did. do you think it's going to work? Yeah, so I was a little skeptical because, you know, I'm a, I'm a novice, but yep. I didn't know anything about how like you put stuff. duct tape and stuff. Yeah. I guess it blows right through it. I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> so but now that so I know powerful, that. Right, so we were telling you they're so powerful that right. they're actually going to blow clear through that right. duct tape. Right, and I had no and idea. you had no idea. Yeah, no, so that's pretty cool. But yeah. other than that, I, I feel pretty good about it. I'm super excited. This is my first fireworks show. You're pretty so. excited. Awesome. And uh, we were actually talking about this, but your first firework display that you've been on was bigger than mine. You bet it is. <laughs> <laughs> Sucker. <laughs> All right, so Michael, you helped set all of this up, all of these racks. We loaded them with shells and everything. What do you think was the hardest part about setup? Oh, God, definitely taking out all of the tubes from the back of the pickup. Oh, yeah, because they were uh, all in the back of this pickup right here. Yeah, yeah. and then setting them into And putting the them into the milk crates. It, you think that was definitely the hardest? Definitely. There was a yeah. lot of tubes. So loading the shells, a little tedious, but I mean, the, I mean, the we tubes music. were the hardest part. So yeah. it was well, fun. Looks like you time. guys are pretty excited. Yeah, dude, I am oh, yeah. stoked. I'm really yeah. excited for the finale. <laughs> Can't wait to see how it turns out. <laughs> all right, Cody, interview time for you. <laughs> well, I've been asking you guys all the questions. I know, so now it's your turn. Yeah. How do you feel about it? Like, well, how, what's what's your mindset going into this? Okay, I'll be honest. Um, I was originally a little nervous about the fiberglass tubes going in the milk crates because um, we all know if fiberglass blows up, it actually just explodes, whereas in HDP piping, it expands. So if anything were to happen in one of these where we use the fiberglass tubes, sure, might be bad, but yeah. we have insurance, so... Not <laughs> ideal, see. not I'm ideal. I'm really excited, but, you know, with this many milk crates, if there was ever going to be anything to go wrong, it's going to be tonight. Right, and okay, so now, so now, what was the hardest part? The hardest part. Oof, the hardest part. Or maybe the most annoying, What? either one. So the hardest part and most annoying was definitely hauling them out here and setting them up on I can site. agree with that. Uh, I just threw out my back today, so... Yep. Yeah, it's, it was a lot of work. I mean, uh, it doesn't look like it, but um, I'm going to actually put a clip right here of the trailer flexing the Tahoe. Look at this thing squat. The airbags are kicking in to raise it up. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear that, but uh, that right there is our fireworks show. And this thing is <laughs> 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 And uh, yeah, it was just, it was crazy. This is so much weight. I think it's definitely over a thousand pounds of shells. Do you think it's going to be worth it? I think it's going to be worth it. I do too. So on the Cobra Show Builder, it's pretty simple actually. Um, you just set each module as a channel. Mm -hmm. So instead of naming it Module 1 or whatever, it's called Channel 1. And then um, you just put in what time you want it to go. So even if you have it in at, even if you're shooting multiple positions, you just put the same time mm -hmm. on each module and those will all fire at the same exact time then. So this is Module 1, I got Sugar Skull right there. And on Module, three sugar scrolls gonna fire over there at the same time, 203. So it's really simple as you can get. Cool. Yeah, I was impressed.
right, it's time to welcome 2021 in three, two, one. There we go. Oh yeah. I'm gonna give this to you. Uh, you're gonna come with me, okay? What's happening? <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh.
Oh my oh, god! Dude! That was awesome! Oh. <laughs> yeah! Woo! 21 coming in! <laughs> Let's go! Oh, oh, oh. Yes! Oh my god, that was awesome! Dude, I seen that fuse go. Oh, yeah. like, oh gee lord! <laughs> oh my god, guys, that was insane! Look at this! Look at all the paper! <laughs> Riley, what did we just do? What did we just do? That was insane! Holy Street sweeper! Holy! Oh my god, what'd you we think? We did that! We was that did everything that. you expected and more? That was way that more was than incredible. I expected. Oh my we god. That. We did that. Welcome we to 2021. Let's oh leave 2020 behind us. That was awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you next time.